This is not where I started out. I was born in New Bedford, and as a child, my parents moved, it seemed, every other day, and we lived eight places in New England until I was in 12th grade. I always knew I was meant to be an artist. I was not a well child, but nobody could ever find out what was wrong with me. I had a choice from my parents, a nursing school or to be a teacher. Well, I didn't like school, so I certainly wasn't going to be a teacher. So I became a nurse. I worked as a nurse for 10 years. In 1984, I was diagnosed with multiple sclerosis. It was devastating. I went on, I bettered myself. I always felt nursing school wasn't enough for me. I went to college, I graduated. I had many, many different jobs. And I was successful. By 1994, my health had declined so, and I was forced to retire. I went out on disability, and from 1994 till 2008, I was not well. So I started to paint, and when I started to paint, I found I could lose myself. And I started to paint when I was well, and I did the work that you see on my website over a course of 10 years. I opened my home for open studios. And we had 800 people come through the door and it was unanimous. My work was wonderful. From open studios, I was asked to do my first gallery show. And this is where we are now, in the midst of my gallery show. This exhibit at the university, our gallery has never looked uh, as bright as uh, brighter than it looks now. Um, the work, uh, um, Anne's work, is absolutely extraordinary. Uh, I myself was, before I even got to the gallery, found myself just completely pulled to it. Uh, when I was standing across the plaza, um, we were so excited that she's uh, been willing to share her work with us, and our students, and our faculty, and our staff are excited to have the opportunity to come and view it. Uh, uh, in, in this magnificent way. So uh, we're thankful to her and I'm going to get back to uh, taking a I feel like I'm living a dream. I paint my paintings deep within my soul and I pull the ideas out of the atmosphere. And now I'm sitting in a gallery surrounded by 28 pieces of my work and it's all so surreal. I give you my heart and soul when my brush hits the canvas and to see it appreciated and people loving it and laughing and smiling and talking about the colors and the feelings that they evoke is just beyond description. My whole life has been renewed. You look at me and you say, well, she's no youngster. I have news for you. I'm 21 and starting over, and you better believe it.